one of our favorite tales was one of the very first appearances that predates uh, most of the uh, live shows from ZZ Top. We were down in Texas and uh, we were all set to deliver our two hours of uh, freshly written material. And when the curtains opened, we were greeted to the paying customer of one guy. <laughs> the famous one guy. When the curtains opened, uh, you know, there he was. Uh, we went ahead and uh, looked at each other, shrugged our shoulders, said, okay, uh, let's carry on. We played for the first hour. We took a break. We walked down, uh, took the guy out of the lobby, bought him a Coke, came back and finished the night out with the second hour. And uh, as the gear was being loaded up, we heard the clip pop of horseshoes. And I want to say the guy probably came to the show on horseback. <laughs> As he made his way back through the uh, desert sand and cactus, you know, uh, that's the that's the real Texas experience, of course. He's a true Texan. He has had the same cowboy hat since day one. I think he, to this day, he's a real working cowboy. Uh, he had on uh, his dusty, rusty, trusty uh, Levi's tucked into some fancy boots and uh, he, he was actually covered with mud and dust. What a guy. He's still a fan. He comes around every uh, so often, unannounced by the way, and uh, ironically he's remained the mystery fellow. He has yet to reveal his true name. He only goes by, I'm the guy. <laughs> so. We, we can recognize him, uh, we, we uh, you know, now we're talking five decades of watching this guy grow up with ZZ Top. And to this day, he's, he's just, there's the guy. Sooner than later, the curtain shall rise. And uh, if that's the case, we're gonna be looking out for, guess who? The guy. <laughs> This is Billy F. Gibbons. We're going to get the wheels rolling. <laughs>